I started beekeeping about eight years ago and started my company five years ago. I picked up a book randomly one day about bees and was fascinated and I kept reading, buying more books and it eventually led to making naturally flavored infused honeys with my company Mellifera Bees. So the amount of honey that you get from a hive depends on quite a few factors. So weather, the strength of your colony, and how much nectar availability there is. So that can be anywhere from nothing if it's a dry and a poor year for your bees health, up to 200 pounds per hive. So I used to keep bees all throughout uh, Vancouver in different backyards and recently have moved all the bees to Galliano and also downsize the amount of hives that I'm personally looking after. So I'm looking after six hives at the moment and then I'm also supporting other local beekeepers and using their honey in Mellifera bees. So the honey that I'm using is from local beekeepers from the Fraser Valley as well as some of my own bees who are living currently on Galliano Island. There's different ways that you can get flavor into honey. You can get flavor from the nectar source itself. So bees can visit a blueberry field, collect the blueberry nectar, and then you have a blueberry nectar honey. I'm infusing the honey, so I'm taking the honey after the fact, and I'm taking natural ingredients and adding it into the honey so it naturally flavors. There's another way that you can get flavor into a honey, which is with concentrate flavorings, which is a lot of the flavored honeys you see. So for example, I'll take organic, fairly traded vanilla beans. I leave that into the honey. The flavor of the vanilla beans naturally mixes in. We strain out the vanilla beans and then bottle that honey. My honey is available at through Vancouver Farmers Markets. This year I'm going to be at the um, West End Market, the Kitsilano Market, and hopefully picking up days at other markets like the Trout Lake Market. And then we're also sold through smaller boutique retailers, um, design-driven gift shops like Walrus, Much and Little. Um, we're at the Gourmet Warehouse. We're at Boku Bakery. And then we're also found at the four Vancouver Whole Foods stores.